To reproduce Debbie's artwork, we used lots of liquid rubber and liquid plastic. And these things come in five gallon buckets and they have to be measured accurately. So you're pouring from a five gallon bucket and you're trying to get like six ounces or eight ounces. And it's kind of tricky. I'm pretty good at putting the buckets on the table and rolling them sideways, but that takes a clear table. And Debbie doesn't do it that way. She just tries to pour them. And we're getting ready to reproduce these big molds. So we're going to have helpers here. And we're going to be having people that have never poured out of a five-gallon bucket before. So I thought I'd make a, a, a holder to help pour the stuff and to hold the bucket and just make it a little safer and neater and more accurate. Now, I didn't invent these things. They're, they're for sale. And there's, they're on the Internet. And they're on YouTube and I just looked at a couple of pictures and got some ideas and then went and looked around the shop and see what I had that I could use and this is a video of me putting them together with the stuff I had in this case I actually had a bunch of new flat bar which is unusual but that made it a little easier that it all matched I have deleted lots of footage of grinding. Seems like for every five minutes I spend welding, I spend 20 minutes grinding and it's terribly boring. And I've also lost, well, I didn't lose. The camera battery went dead at the final assembly, so there's not much uh, documentation of it, but it's pretty straight, straightforward. Just a welding, it was kind of a fun little project. Enjoy. Because the handle ended up 
making one side heavier. They wanted to like tip over backwards with, with no bucket. So put this little kickstand. That took care of that. And now they work pretty well. Simply setting a bucket in there makes pouring a one-handed operation instead of a two-handed operation. And when the bucket gets really empty, you can lock it down. So when you tilt it really far, you don't have to worry about the bucket falling out, knocking your cup over. Mm -hmm.